Uh, okay, we got pen, 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 pendulums. Sun gun is not great for this. Popped off three rounds that I really did not mean to. Again, more choice, and I think also maybe an elevator. That one at the end, anything? Okay, mate. You didn't get stunned enough. Okay, I'm taking lots of damage, I think. Oh yeah, I'm taking lots of damage, so thank you, please. Okay, please be something, thank you. Mm, it's not really getting to me too much, maybe because the slurpers are not here. Um, is this just going off because of Valtiel? Oh yeah, Valtiel's doing something. Torturing someone. Thankfully not us. Um, useless door. Doesn't feel like any church I've been to. Naturally. Okay. Kind of expecting the little girl to be here somewhere. But I guess not. Um, it's actually been a little bit since we've gotten a save point. Um, and that kind of worries me. Drawing book. My sketchbook from 17 years ago when you were... Fetus? I don't know. On the front cover, there's a picture of Dad. Really awful work. I think that same image was used in Silent Hill 1. What's it doing here? I don't know. Door sure does rattle, but it's stuck tight. A secret hidden out of your sight. You may be thinking, what could it be? You'll need five magic cards if you want to see. What to do then with all these? I'll tell you straight, I won't, and I won't tease, just as long as you say please. Now, the first thing you must know is that something there's something for, in every row, but that is not the half of it. Three would be too hard to fit. The upside-down man under the ground. To his right, to his left, there's no one around. Leave him alone. The though his tears are profound. The moon is up above the sky, fuller crescent floating high, twinkling light sits like a crown on the head of a crazy clown. Your Excellency, praying to God most high, do you think you can tell me why you always look up at the night sky? Do you have it now? Did You didn't forget one major point you must not omit. And now at the last, before you take a whack, here's one more hint to keep you on track. Scary and hateful, that thing in the night. Better be careful, it's not a... And you're right. Turn to the left and you'll keep it in sight. So you'll open the door. I'm just sure that they, that there'll be nothing beyond it but frightening peril. It's a little awkward with the rhyme scheme. Forget about that. Just stay and play or else I'll be left here all alone all day. This is supposed to be hints on how you arrange the cards. Um. Um. So these, I think, are just a reference to... Um, yeah, the save points in Silent Hill 1, which were, like, these little, I got a brass key. Oh, there's a save point here, too. I'm going to use it in just a sec, but I want to make sure that I have what I need. That's the outfit that Alyssa wears in Silent Hill 1. Um, it's like a school uniform of sorts. Um, I guess in Silent Hill Origins as well, but I don't know much about that game. Um, okay, wh where... On the chair, and it's on the chair. There's just a lot of symbolism here, some hints on... Right? Now let's... You're examining the notebook again. I don't need you to do that. Um, read through the Aglophitus book on the chair to get the full tarot card inside. On the chair? What am I missing? I guess I'm not looking in the right place right now. Did I miss a, a room? Did I miss a room? Hold on, I'm not gonna save just yet. As foolish a decision as that probably is, did I just completely miss a room? Oh yeah, I did. Oh yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, we got it. Um, Insane Cancer, or Closer, you're a Closer. You're also a Closer. Very Closer of you. Okay, I'll come back for the save room later. I probably should have just saved, swallowed my pride and saved. Um, in fact, 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 yes, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna save the game, because I don't think I've saved in a little bit, just, and we're, and we've already come into contact with the scrapers and I've had to use a few health items, and just precautions, 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 
Because I am not your strongest soldier. I don't know why I bothered playing on normal instead of easy. I could never play this game on hard. Or maybe I could. I don't know. Okay, save here. <sighs> okay. Please save my stuff. I think this has only been nine minutes of gameplay, which doesn't really include cutscenes, I guess. It's locked. Okay, this is... Oh yeah, this is where we use the cards. Okay. So we need two left before we can go in here. I do feel a little better now that I've gotten save. I've gotten save. Leave me alone. I said leave me alone. I'm not your mom! Somebody call their mom! That's... I watched a lot of Rugrats as a kid, and that's probably one of the most memorable scenes. Oh, okay. We got another crying girl. Okay, just uh, slowly watch her footsteps. I think it's a little less obvious where it's leading you to this time compared to the last one because it was a giant painting the last time. Okay. Well, let's go in here. Let's go back in here. Okay. You okay, Heather? I mean, you're never okay because you're in just... I don't know. The, like the term Jordan underneath used backwards wonderland has stuck with me about this... <laughs> like his description of this and I know he disowned those videos, but I don't know still Something neat to me. I think just a neat way of putting it the full tarot card So I have one more than I need to get Red liquid or crystals resembling blood according to the Kabbalah the name is taken from an herb with the power to dispel evil spirits It is said to grow in Arabian deserts. It may be vaporized or applied as a Paltis to guard against demons. It is powerful, but as it is rare, it is extremely difficult to obtain. Isn't it? Isn't it? A uh, picture of me when I was seven. Well not, well, not Heather seven, but Alessa seven. Got an ampoule. <sighs> that is a relief. Get some handgun bullets here, too. I know you got them. Smoke if you got them. We'll rock when the street's clear. Um, yeah, I got plenty of those. What about the machine, machine gun bullets? Got 32 there. Got 160 here. I'm gonna save all of these for the final boss. That's just what I'm gonna do. Um, so I went that way. Tell, take the elevator to the upper room. Um, so now that I got the brass key, I can do stuff up there. And we got a monster spawn in. Um, is there anything at the end of that hallway? No. No, there is not. Okay, yeah. Leave me alone, you bitch. See, I can call these bitches because cancer is a bitch. Okay. 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 <sighs> <clears throat> This way, please. Um, pretty sure just the radio here is just Veltiel. Nothing to be scared of. Veltiel can't hurt us. Unless maybe you can do it. Okay. Scraper, 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 scraper. Don't fall, Heather. Do not. Do not. Okay. I said don't. Okay. I was wondering if that was a mechanic in the game. Yep, it is. Yep, it is. Okay. I have to do stuff over again. Okay. Okay, that didn't take long. Just be careful. Take the scraper hits if you need to. Okay, okay. That's that's all we needed to do. How am I feeling after the scraper, you know, scraped me? You know, that thing that he did. Um... Actually feeling okay. Um... <laughs> Okay, so brass key. Is there anything on the key I can examine? Um, blah, 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 blah. um brass key. No. My old room key. Okay, there was a locked door, I remember. Am I remembering that correctly? 
maybe this level is not as long as I remember it being, but I'm still probably going to save the final boss for a little later. We'll see. Or, or I could do it in the session. There's a car outside that just... Horns go... Never mind. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Um... Okay. So, what was the locked door that we're dealing with? Um, all the way back there! Okay. Okay. Was that painting room anything? It's starting to feel like it's not anything. Um... I don't... Is that just Voltiel? It might just be Voltiel. Started pronouncing his name differently than before. I don't know. He is the pyramid head of this game, kind, except he can't hurt you. He's just everywhere. Also, I think he's, you know, kind of more intimidating. Just a little bit. I don't know, just kind of the design and the fact that, like, yes, he wants you to... <laughs> he, he's kind of allowing you to get through, but he also is just waiting at... Oh, oh! Slurpers, 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 and I can't tell where to get out. Oh, God. Oh, my... Wow. Okay, I'm... Okay, I'm... At, yeah, no, I'm not... Okay! Oh, my God. 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 <laughs> Lord, tell me how to get out of this fucking room. Oh, my God. Everything is red. I forgot about that. And I forgot about this, too. Those insane cancers, they can see me, but they can't get to me. That's good, that's good. Okay, I forgot about that. God damn. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. I'm not freaking out. I'm calm. I'm, I'm calm. I'm calm. I'm lying. I'm calm. I'm lying. I'm calm. Lying? Yes. Calm? No. Hello, Valtiel. You're looking quite well. I can barely see you, but I know you're there. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. Lockers. Are we back in Midwich? You know, this is definitely familiar to Silent Hill 1. I remember going into a lot of classrooms in Silent Hill 1. Oh. Okay, let's see. Um, go home, drop dead thief. Hmm. It used to be Alessa's. I mean, this was my desk once upon a time. Mm-hmm. Is there anything in this classroom, or... Because there wasn't much of, of a gameplay significance in some of the classrooms in the first game. In fact, you could argue that some of the areas of Silent Hill 1 were a bit too... Um bit too open, I guess. Um, the scratches. You also find two clips on the small extension table, but I don't have them, probably because I haven't used the submachine gun once during this playthrough. Uh, so it goes. So it goes. Um, okay, we got a couple cancers, or maybe just that one. I just don't want to deal with them right now. I just want to do what I'm supposed to do tape deck here. Well, then we'll use the tape that we found. It's not a supply, it's a regular item. Please use it. Okay. Do you know about what happened here 17 years ago? You've been here a long time. You must have heard some details. A group of pagans, blinded by earthly desires, spit in the very face of God. They tried to use the seal of Metatron to prevent God's awakening. But God drove the unbelievers away and threw them into the abyss. But due to their wickedness, God was unable to be born properly. And so she has slumbered ever since in the womb of the Holy Mother. Until the time of the awakening. That's all that I know. That's it, huh? Well, thanks. Father Vincent, I heard that the Holy Mother has been found. Is it true? Alessa has been found? 
Did Claudia say that? Yes. Then it must be true. Her sight rarely fails her. Bless the Lord. Maybe it's because of her great faith. But I could never be like her. I wouldn't want to. Nor I. The truth is, Sister Claudia frightens me a little. Well, now, let's both show our faith by forgetting about this little talk, okay? Yes, but... Does that mean this land will finally be the home of eternal paradise? If God wills it, my sister. If God wills it. Ugh. I don't know who that woman is. Only just another nun of sorts. LS. I don't know what. Lots of lots of writings that I don't properly know the meanings of. Am I supposed to find a tarot card in here, or is this just for, like, exposition? I guess, um... Tell me. Use the cassette tape, read the memo on the desk, and exit. Enter the next room on the same side to find the last card. Okay, so yeah, this is this is just so you can use the cassette tape. Is that still in my inventory? Yeah, it is. I don't know why I would leave my inventory. So which way do I have to go once I get out? Either cross or to my right. I'm gonna try cross first. Oh, okay. Um... Um, this is probably nothing. This is pro probably nothing I need to be in. Okay, yeah, um, mistake. S mistakes were made! Mistakes were made. <laughs> um, yeah, there's nothing in there but some scrapers. Um, I thought that was some handgun bullets. Um, November 10th, she didn't die then. She was born. I knew that for a fact. But then why haven't I found her yet? They were supposed to need her power to build paradise for the happiness of the people. She was supposed to be reborn for that. I'd really like to see her. November 14th. Read the Book of Praise. I want to thank Father for lending me such an invaluable book. I found what I'd been searching for in there. How to awaken God. But it's too much too cruel. Will I be able to pull it off when I see her? I was free all day, so I read A Modern History of Refugees and Young Slaves' Child Exploitation. I don't want to be a mere bystander in this world. I can't do anything now, though, and that's what's hard. Oh, boy. It's just a candle. And there's the final tarot card. Um, old birthday card. Anything in here? To little Claudia, happy sixth birthday. I love you as if you were my real sister. Here's to you. Who could that have been from? I don't know. Okay, we have everything we need to go ahead and finish the game. I'm gonna, I'm not gonna cut to me getting back to where I need to be. That, you can be sure- uh, Ah! Okay. Of course. Of fucking course. Okay. No, I wanted- I wanted the select menu. Okay, that's actually a lot. No more of those, but I have five ampoules, so hopefully that'll be enough. You're just blocking the entire fucking hallway. Isn't that just lovely? Hit the scraper, please. Okay. Fall down. Die. Get out of my way! Just die! Let me walk through you! Stupid gluttonous hog. Get out of the way! I've kicked you like seven times now! I st oh my god! Am I okay? Health drink. Okay, is this gonna be enough? Going up against the final boss? I think it will be. I barely have any bull- ha Shotgun bullets. I barely have any shotgun bullets. It's quite sad, actually. So I guess I'm gonna have to rely on the submachine gun. Hope that's gonna be enough. Along with my handgun bullets. Final boss is gonna take a long time. I can just feel it. <sighs> okay, I gotta go back in this terrifying ass room. 
Um, actually, you know what? I'm going to save. I'm going to save the game before I save the game and save the world. How's that sound? This is... Oh, I, I thought I was going back to the big room. But yeah, I... <laughs> I might as well do this, take another bathroom break, and then try to make my way back to the tarot card room. And I'm gonna take you along for the ride. I ain't cutting that out. So how do you feel now? How do you feel now, Heather? You're about to face your destiny. About to face your destiny as the mother of God, I guess. Right? Going the right way. Got that one terrifying room of all red. Just remember that the door is on the same side, basically, and you have to just do a little roundabout with slurpers and scrapers and all that fun-ass shit that you'd love so much. Um. Only got hit once that time. Good. Okay. Um, I'm not gonna heal yet. Can I just not? Can I just not? Can I just not? Oh, it would be nice if I could not. Just gotta remember the way through. Keep opening the map every six seconds. This is true, authentic Silent Hill 3 gameplay. You've come to know and love. Ugh. Okay. So I have decided I am going to save the final boss for another recording session because, you know, I think it's going to be appropriate to just leave the ending of the game as its own video anyway without it really being split. I could use the uh, little. Um... Okay, now we got now we got some uh, sick all over here. That's cool. That's nice. Don't scrape at me, please. Please do not scrape at me. Um... Okay, other direction, I guess. Can I use the stun gun to try to deal with these stupid ass scrapers? I think that's what I'm gonna do. Just, this final stretch is just my trek to get back to safety. Or relative safety, you know? Which door? Um, this one. This one. I've, I thought that the church area was sh longer, honestly. I'm just, okay. Please. Oh my god. Okay, okay, hold on. That's brought you to the ground at the very least. But I took some damage. More damage than I would like to be taking right now. Oh, nope. Refill that, honey. Refill that, sweetheart. Okay. Very end. Do not fall. Do not... Not get taken by the pendulums, please, please, please. I am not carcinogen. I am not your strongest soldier. I am not the most dangerous thing in these hallways. Not by a long fucking shot. Not by a long shot. Okay. <sighs> okay. Here we are again. Let's do the tarot card puzzle. So this is based on a riddle. I don't have really the mental fortitude to try to get through it now, like step by step. I don't know. If, I don't know if you need to do these. Um, but I think if you just use one, you use them all. I've got the solution right in front of me. I've got the moon tarot card. It goes here. The high priestess tarot card. Goes here again. Um, the riddle tells you how you're supposed to do this, you know, in, a, in an obtuse way, as you ordinarily would be. Hanged man goes here, and the fool goes here, and it's different depending on your difficulty level. So we've done that, and we're gonna save. In the next video of Silent Hill 3, we're beating the game. We're gonna kill God 
And I'm not kidding. That is what we are going to do. Somehow, it's only really counting a little over an hour and a half of gameplay. <laughs> Money, you know, cut scenes and being in menus, that stuff. I think that just freezes the clock. Correct me if I'm wrong. This is not a bad time, bad in-game time at least. So, take care. Thank you.